That's crazy. Oh, I see the spooky man up here. Spooky man gone. Yeah, what about the parents up here now? Mr. and Mrs. Martin. <laughs> oh, there's lightning outside now. Oh, yeah, that's so sick. That's so moody. I love that. His glasses. Bob's glasses? So in the first game, I just had the the gray thing. Now it looks like the gray thing with blood on it, or is it the gray thing and red thing? Hello? I love that he has a... Look at the spooky guy down here. Hello? Okay. Hello. Hello. Also, I saw that someone dropped the first message in, in chat. I'm going to say hi, whoever that was. Uh, just give me a second. Dude, okay. Damn, so the this one has so much gameplay in comparison to the other two. John, I'm getting reports of children exhibiting strange behavior at the daycare center on 4th Street. If Nate and Jason are there, then you can bet that is the place where they will try to summon Malfus. There is no time left. Go to the daycare and find out what's really going on. Fear not. Vaya con Dios, Father Garcia. Okay. Whoop. Leave? No. I've barely... Why am I stopping here? Because the cop drove past? Is this the daycare? Excuse me? Anything a priest could do to help? Yeah, looks like a daycare, alright. These cops didn't even <laughs> check the back. And I'm not going to tell them that I found a way in. Yeah, nailed it. A riddle, priest. How do you make a portal to hell? Come see me and I'll show you. It's not a riddle. Mostly just a question. Okay. We're gonna have some communication stuff going on here. Ben! Ben, you still here? I mean, I knew that you could draw, but this, this is something else. <laughs> Great artiste. Okay. Mother Moon watcheth her little ones behind a door. Of sleep. Daughter Chalice is filled, an offering to the master in the unseen world. Spirit bird arriveth 
from afar and cometh back to roost. These vessels are the unholy trinity. The fallen star shall guide them. What colors can you see? Look to the children if you are lost. Okay, so we got like a color puzzle going on here. Okay, there are more drawings. Red star, gold moon, I guess. Is that Super Mario down there? So if we're just supposed, am I, am I just uh, overthinking it with all this, with all the people and everything? And I should just be like, looking in the things so like this one should just be orange this one should be red feel like the bird should be me so daughter chalice is filled an offering to the master in the unseen world she's filled so like like the filled with liquid like the rain cloud maybe oh this feels like an offering which would mean pink uh, chalice, I guess. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I got it before I saw this. Bird. Blue bird. I guess I'll go down here and look. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> all just shooting each other as well yeah i mean that makes sense mother moon watches behind the uh, yeah whatever we just this one was supposed to be uh, gold right and then we said that this one should be pink right and that the bird should be blue so it's twitter down here sorry i mean x and this one should be red thank you this is where it lives. Get Jesus. T nice. I loved hearing that. Also, gonna turn the volume up for you just a little bit because it's so low for you. And if I'm gonna suffer, so are you. Hey, Colts. What is this even? If you are reading this, then congratulations. You are on your way to experience the wonders of our unspeakable future under the guidance of Gary. Gary, our brother. Gary, our friend. Gary, a normal human being just like you and me. <laughs> Yeah, that doesn't sound conspicuous at all. Gary, just a normal human. Nothing weird about Gary. You can trust Gary so much that I just... Let me just throw this out here in case you were wondering. Gary is just a normal human human guy. He's just, an every, he's just a man. He's just a guy. Nothing to worry about. As a tier one acolyte, you are just beginning your unspeakable journey to eventually see what Gary sees and prove yourself worthy to be a vessel fit to experience the second death, reserved for only the most worthy. To find out if you are a vessel, remember to attend meetings of the eternal order of the second death twice a week. Follow Gary's instructions exactly. Be honest with him in all that you do. Do not ever ask what is behind the door in the basement of the clinic. I'm back. What's going on? Spooky. Recap so far. Sp sp skel skeleton spooky. She consumed six little twigs. Only two were left to walk as husks. Go ahead, priest. Stare into the eyes of my mother. Mother? Am I supposed to be doing something? Is this just happening over time? With me doing nothing? Or was it because I was kind of walking? 
I'm now holding space. I don't know if this has anything to do with me holding space or if this is just... I told you spooky skeletons. Oh, we're getting loud. <laughs> this is normal. <laughs> Painting absolutely not okay. Painting, Painting blood. blood. Gaze upon the magnificence of La Pieta, Corota. This beautiful statue depicts a faithful member, a faithful member of the order, <laughs> receiving the second death in the loving embrace of Et Mater. Two such statues were commissioned thanks to the generous patronage of the Save family. Patronage? What does that? It, that reminds me of something. It's like a. Like a patreon.com slash jeffy or some shit like that. We invite everyone to reverently approach the statue whenever they are in need of rest. Get Jesus. If you're reading this, congratulations. You have officially been granted Tier 2 status in the Eternal Order of the Second Death. Upon crossing the threshold from Tier 1 to Tier 2, your life as an acolyte will... Oh, nah, that word is fucking weird. Hold on. We are looking at how to pronounce these words and more confusing vocabulary too many people get wrong. Stay tuned. Loads to learn here. Acolyte. Stress on the first syllable. Both British and American English pronunciations are similar here. Acolyte. 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 Now you know. Yes, I do. <clears throat> Acolyte. Upon crossing the threshold from Tier 1 to Tier 2, your life as an Acolyte will change dramatically. You may start noticing shadowy figures in the corners of rooms, or experience feelings of lost time when holding sharp objects. Ancient symbols written in blood will materialize on the floor and walls of your home. Animals will no longer trust you. You may emit a foul odor that will cause your former loved ones to avoid you. These are just a few of the marvelous blessings that await you in this new stage of life. If you remain loyal to... Gary. Your journey towards becoming a vessel for... The second death will progress to new levels of knowledge and power. Remember, if you neglect your weekly meetings or do not pay your tithes to the order, your fingers will be forcibly bent backwards. Gary loves you. If you don't pay your boobs, yeah. Bail giveth favor, the low seats are made high. Five seats in the north facing west, five in the south facing east. Andras soweth discord, east and west trade places. Ordog stirreth his pot full of sinners, the seats revolve. Oh my god, what is this? Yeah, right, like, I, I don't think I've ever felt so strongly right away that, like, oh uh, yeah, this puzzle sounds annoying. You have to sort the chairs according to the bottom left description. Yes, I, I, I kind of assume so as well. But that means that I need to, like, keep track of the... of where the chairs are. Uh, 
see? There's then there's this fucker. I think it's not solvable if I'm understanding. Mortis? Oh shit, it's Cyberpunk 2077. The jab. I was gonna make a. I love this. This is so sick. Oh, is it really? I was gonna make a vaccine joke. This is what the vaxxers want. I wonder what, like, software he used to do the... the animations. I know he did it over footage. Now you are ready. I do understand that I'm very... Oh! Hello? What am I looking at here? Is it pixelated? Are they doing mosaics in this already... Hello? Why can't I... I don't remember anything further. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing I can't do it from here either. Yeah, okay. Oh, you do? That's fun. Oh, I'd love to see how that's going for you. Feel free to... Uh, send me something on Discord later. Is it me he's asking for? Is this like a skinwalker thing? It's like mimicking. If you're wondering, I couldn't uh, do anything there. Oh, there's a crawly guy down here. You're not dead, buddy? What if we let him get to the end of the screen? Does he just crawl off? A lot has happened, Tommy. And also nothing. But mostly a lot. Deliver two onto Moloch's hands before opening his navel. What? Filthy acolyte. The substance of Gary's influence flows through your veins. You are corrupted beyond repair. 
Your family and friends have forsaken you. There is no returning from the path you have chosen. Only Gary can save you now. Give up and fully let him into your heart and mind. If you do so, he will make you into a vessel worthy of the unspeakable. Resist and your soul will be lost forever. Welcome to Tier 3. Gary loves you. This is honestly just like House of Leaves. Okay, that brings me back here. Interesting. What is this thing? I'm guessing there's gonna be one soon-ish. There's gonna be one last big bad final boss. supposed to do there I have to get up nice and close to the mirror to get him to but then I go down in the in the real world to go around him yeah I get fucked in that shit that's one of the sacrifices I'm supposed to put on the thing, I bet. What is that even? It's like a rot, like a, you know, kind of like House of Leaves, if you know what I mean. <laughs> is Silly String the stuff that you had in like the Spider-Man web shooter? You put like a thing on your wrist and then you shot out a thing. Is that what Silly String is? Because that's not like a big thing in Sweden, but I had the Spider-Man web shooter thing. <laughs> I think you're thinking of cum. Yeah, you might be, <laughs> you might be right. <laughs> oh, blah, blah. Okay, so I shouldn't be backtracking. I should just walk through this room several times. Mortis? Mortis. Okay. Okay. Got him. Nope, okay. It didn't take the... I need to do the mirror guy again. What the fuck is this now? Who is that? Who's that guy? No, fuck you! Fuck that thing! Can I cross it? Oh my god. I'm gonna die. I'm in a mental asylum. How am I even supposed to keep track of... No, 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 no. Let me in. Okay, now I'm here. Okay, so that was just like a little extra mini boss, I guess. Let's see if I can do this one again without dying. No, the little skull isn't even here. I think my brain is slowly getting a bit fried after so many hours of this game today. Die! Let 
Let's pray, play red light, green light. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I think it's just you. I do not feel that he's any faster. One would think that you'd, you know, kind of hurry up a little bit. But no. I can probably do other shit now to get different endings, but I'm just gonna go in here. You are now a tier 4 Acolyte. You have descended beyond everything that could possibly save you. Your words are not your own. Your actions are not your own. You belong, body and spirit, to Gary. Your face itches for the warm embrace of the ritual mask. You long for the blinding pain of the knife. You truly are Gary's chosen vessel. Fear not. Only a little longer and you will experience the second death. Adios, alma perdita. Gary loves you. So I, I'm gonna I'm gonna confess that at some point I totally lost the plot. Like I have no idea what's happening. Am I actually just like giving in to this and being a demonic vessel for this cult? If so, why are they all attacking me? Or am I like infiltrating and I'm like, no, I'm not actually a vessel. This is supposed to be for someone who's here because they're a vessel, but I'm not. I'm infiltrating, you know? Um, yeah. I mean, you can probably piece it together, but I have not. And you would have to kind of, I don't know, watch a four-hour Wendigoon video. I mean, I am still carrying around a cross that I can hurt people with. Oh, this, the fucking darkness is chasing me, kind of. No, okay, it just comes based on the further down the screen I go. I thought it was maybe, you know. This feels like it's leading to the end, like a quiet part of just walking, nothing happening. I guess the thing is that I don't want to divide this into yet another stream session, uh, but it also is getting... Oh, that's so nice. I love that. It is getting a bit too much for one sitting or two sittings in a day. Um, so if I seem a bit more critical than what is maybe fair, that's why. I love those. Those are just like House of Leaves. 
I guess I do actually still think this is really sick. T-shirt with this is just like Elsa leaves. That would actually, I would love that. That would actually be a really good uh, <laughs> merch. It's a bit too niche for like the six people who've been here during the stream, but... The fuck? No, Jesus. Where do I start? Where do I start? Okay, here. Let's try another direction for now. And if someone asks like, oh, but like, what's House of Leaves? You don't need to know anything about it. You can just go like, it's a, it's a book, but like, I can't even begin to explain. Okay. Like, I don't know if I'm making any progress. At one point, I freed like two of them to open two of the gate things, and now I feel like I've just walked around for so long. Okay, here's one. Mortis. If I don't get it, then I'm gonna end it off. Oh, here's one. Okay, we got one. Now I'm almost gonna assume that there isn't another one out here in the void. Now I just go back to the left to get back to like the symbol. Should be here. No, next one. Okay, so I can't like find my way back to that. I'm just like. I'm just like in a perpetual void until I find four of these. And this is how you die, because this is like the edge up there. And if you're close to an edge, you'll be surrounded by these fucking things. The trail just ends here. Like, is this another trail? Oh my god, I could go up there? You're fucking kidding me. The fuck is this? My dearest colleague Jacob, thank you for the letter. I am delighted to hear of the success of your venture in Pennsylvania. However, it was not enough to persuade me to join your cause. I have no interest in crumbling ghost towns, nor government experiments, nor the gibbering behemoths that lurk shamefully in the darkness between worlds. Such matters are not worthy of my expertise. My methods may be more delicate than yours, but I assure you that they were given to me straight from the source. The Antichrist, the Antichrist will step forth very soon. The second death will consume this world, this pitiful fleshy sphere, still in its infancy, yet everlastingly too late to redeem. When the time comes, I hope we may reunite as cohorts, albeit not as equals. Love always, Gary. P.S. I almost forgot to thank you for the pet. I will keep it outside my private quarters as a guard against intruders. Is that something we've seen before? Is that the white thing? Got a cool guy with shades here in the middle. I respect that. No, 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 you don't, you don't, you fucking don't. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fucking die. I think that's where we ended off for today, and I'll finish this in another session, because Jesus Christ. Where does it start me now? No, yeah, no, <laughs> yeah. I think we'll, uh, I think we'll finish this, uh... But not today. Been going for three and a half hours, and we did another, what, like three hours stream before this? It's uh, eight in the evening, and I feel like I've uh, streamed many hours today. 
Um, all that being said, though, this game's very cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna give some some uh, full thoughts on it eventually once we've finished it. Uh, summarized, I can say that currently I don't know how much I fuck with pushing the narrative so far and making it so long. I really, really liked the first one, and I really liked the second one, and I liked the third one. You know, they get increasingly complex, and I don't know how much that fits the sort of like slow walking simulator with a strong narrative that you're trying to solve. Uh, I don't know how much that gains from from making the gameplay increasingly more complex. You know, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, shit. We'll uh, I'll I'll finish this off next time I stream. I don't know if that's tomorrow or the day after that, or it's gonna be soon because I don't want to drag this out. Um, if you're really unlucky, I'll I'll even do it off stream and just uh, record it. But I don't think so. Hey, what's up? Uh, for the rest of this video, it won't be a stream VOD because I didn't feel like doing another stream, but I still want to finish this. Uh, so there's going to be a bit less commentary from here on out. But, you know, I'll, I'll still throw in a few quips here and there. Uh, but yeah, let's get going. Yes, okay. Fucking one more. No, that's all of them? Okay, all I have to do is not die. Famous last words. Oh, I'm so curious to how this map actually looks if you don't have all the... If it wasn't all dark, you know? No. No! 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 The thing is, I'm never gonna be able to find my way back here. Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, do you really want to open this door? I do. Again, like I'm not sure that's a riddle. that Gary? Hello. Hello. Lord, help me. Somebody please help me. This is too much for me. I am so afraid. Please let me escape this place. Some popcorn. I just want to go home. I'll do whatever you want. Just take me away from here. So this is like the coward's ending. I swear it.
with the world behind all this. It's a day of the Lord. I demand to know what the hell is going on here. <laughs> <laughs> He's got six shades on. Well, you have come this far. I suppose you deserve some action. Fine. I'd love that. Young, but no more. Oh. Let's go with Gary. Those are the the twins, right? Yeah, I want to ask about those. I like the lost her glitch there. This is the last question. I mean, I'm way more into the story, like about Amy, than the whole lore thing. So I'm gonna go with Amy. Yeah, same. Nice glitching there. Is this going to be a final boss battle, or is, am I just going to get sacrificed? Okay. On oh, that thing, what the fuck? Oh my god, my reach is so short. No! Oh, I hate that! <sighs> Move! Why do I get so slow sometimes? And he makes me slow, and that happens? What the fuck? Give me that shit, give me that shit. No, 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 no. Oh, this is bullshit. Where's the cross? Up there, I'm fucked. At the same time... Ah, well, now I'm dead. Jesus Christ. Again? I hope this means that he's about to die and that's... Oh my god. 
come on, dude. No fucking way. Oh! Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? No, I don't feel like it is. Yes, it is. Oh my god. What? Shoot them, father. Can I also attack these? Oh, I can, but I died. Okay. Fucking Mortis supercut. Every Mortis from <laughs> from the first from the first game to the last. Every time I die, supercut. You don't have to do that. Don't you? Oh, okay. Who's this Mortis guy? Richard Mortis. Oh, I got her. Oh shit! No. No. Simple in terms. Oh! Boop, 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 boop. Oh no, I'm so dead here! Fuck! No! I'm standing too far down. Uh, I'm dead. Oh my god, why am I so slow? Here. Boom! Fucking power of Christ compels you, you... Okay. So it does something. Or maybe not. Okay. And she got me right away. Jesus Christ. Yeah. What? Okay, so it didn't like that. It comes next, but let's just guess. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I think you got it. <laughs> I couldn't I could I couldn't help myself but to quickly hit space and bring out my fucking crucifix as it's walking away. Yeah. <gasps> Fuck. How did I how did I avoid him the first time there? Oh! Jesus Christ. More. Hoppa! God fucking damn it. <laughs> Jesus. Mortis? Mortis. What the fuck? Gah! Gah! No! Fucking cock! Mm hmm. I didn't hold... I wasn't holding my keyboard. Oh! Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna run. 
No, he gets me. Down here in the... I feel uh, a little dumb. Ah, fuck. Oh, oh. Fuck me, dude. Both of these at once? No, oh no, oh no. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fucking die. I think that's where we ended off. No, 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 no! Cross. Up there, I'm fucked. Can I also attack these? Oh, I can, but I die. Okay. Oh, I thought they would insta-die. That's on me. It does not feel like I'm making any pro- Okay. We were still in the school? Yeah, I'm so confused about the narrative. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Oh, well sick. Are we setting up for a fourth part? Cool. Okay. Well, we're gonna cut to me uh, giving some final thoughts on this whole uh, trilogy. So I thought I'd share some final thoughts after having finished them. So for the first game, we got all the endings. For the second game, I think we got all the en or we like watched one. Uh, for this third one, it, it was so surprisingly uh, long that that you know I'm not I'm not gonna do some completionist thing uh, and try to get them all or even look them all up on, on YouTube. I mean, if you're that interested, I think y you can do that yourself. Um, for some final thoughts on the whole thing. So I really loved the first one, thought it was fucking great. Uh, the second one, pretty much the same, like still also up there, uh, but not it didn't get me as invested, I think. Um, and now for the third one, I'd say it's definitely the one that like gripped me the least. And part of that might definitely be that I perhaps wasn't completely engulfed in the complete story and lore of the whole thing. Um, so, you know, I might be missing some pretty vital aspects of what makes the third one like super engaging. Uh, but that being said, I really liked all three of them. Um, and, 
you know, just the fact that this is mostly made by by a single person uh, in, you know, available software and shit. That's just, it's super inspiring. I, I'd say that one of the sickest aspects of this was how inspired it, it, it made me while playing. I really want to pick up a couple of uh, small game projects that I made myself uh, throughout the years and, and and finish them up or even remaster if I have something finished but and, and you know and just get it out there it would be cool um, but yeah all that being said faith the unholy trinity sick I really liked it first first horror game in a while that actually you know really engaged me and that had me almost throughout the whole thing and I think the reason that it kind of lost me towards the end wasn't really on account of the gameplay uh, or the game or the story or anything but more account of me expecting it to be so much shorter so I was like yeah I'll finish it during this stream session and then I ended up streaming for uh, maybe a few hours too too many uh, in one day uh, but yeah those are my my uh, collected thoughts uh, shout out to Tommy for having to deal with these uh, VODs and then these additional video files that are a mess. So thanks for that. Um, go subscribe to his channel. It'll be in the description, probably some graphics on screen. Uh, and uh, yeah, check out my Patreon main channel, all of that. And I'll talk to you soon. See ya.